So there are two types of milk. One is A1 milk, the other one is A2 milk. If we talk about uh, A1, uh, all the cows which doesn't have a hump, the milk that is being produced by the cows which doesn't have the hump are called A1 milk. The milk which is being produced by the cows which has got the hump are called A2 milk. And uh, why is this A1 and A2? The milk which contains beta casamorphin which is also called BCM7 protein. So, uh, this protein level is very high in a milk called A1 and the consumption of beta casamorphin will actually reduce the calcium level in human body. Whereas, uh, if we talk about male, so they produce calcium every single day so that uh, they don't need the additional support of a calcium to for them to uh, overcome the reduction of a calcium that is happening in the body. Whereas, when we come to women's, so uh, they don't produce calcium every single day. That's the reason, today if you see our mothers and uh, sisters and all would be struggling with uh, knee pains, joint pains, uh, uh, bone pains and all because of this deficiency in the calcium. And how does this happen? Because of the consumption of BCM7 protein. And where do this come from? This comes from uh, milk that we consume. And uh, which milk is that? The milk that uh, uh, cows which doesn't have a hump. They are called A1 cows and the milk that we consume are called A1 milk. So, this is the uh, differentiation that happens with uh, A1 protein. Whereas, if we talk about A2 protein, uh, the cows which has got the hump, they reduce this uh, BCM7 content in the milk. How do they do that? With the hump that they have, they collect the sun rays uh, through the now called Surya Ketu Nadi and they convert this BCM7 protein to a good A2 protein which is very good for human health. So that's the reason today if you see lot of the doctors in the hospitals would be telling go lactose free or go for a desi cow milk. So that's the reason uh, this differentiation of A1 or A2 protein has happened today.